Hi there, my name is Adam Wilbur. I'm a professional magician and I have been for just about my entire life. And in that time, I have studied and performed thousands of effects, looking for the most powerful and emotionally engaging tricks that I could find. And in my search, I have found that a levitation done properly tops the list every time. In fact, a lot of professional magicians say if you're going to do a levitation in your show, it better be what you close with because you simply can't follow something so profound. This to date is my signature piece, the thing that people remember me by and ask for time and time again. I wanted to develop a levitation that meant something to me, that meant something to my audience, and that solved a few of the problems I had with current levitations on the market. So in Grandfather's Top, you don't just get a fully scripted, beautiful piece of magic that you can perform to inspire and motivate people to realize how precious life really is. You also get my method for taking the object while it's floating in midair, waving your hands over it and having it vanish completely, only to end up back in the box that it started in. Okay, that all sounds great, but what exactly is Grandfather's Top? You start with a box that your grandfather gave you, and inside of that is a little wooden toy, but it's not put together yet. That's for your audience to do. As they're putting it together, you tell the story that this is what your grandfather would give you. They figure out how to put the toy together, and they realize it's a spinning top. And then they watch as that top floats about an inch off of your hand. Now, this is the moment where they start wondering, did I just see that? And they really focus in. Then you spin it in your hand again, and they watch as it goes from one hand to the next. On the third phase of the routine, it doesn't just spin from one hand to the other, it spins all around your body in a magical way as if it takes on a life of its own. In the final phase of the routine, your audience watches as the spinning top vanishes out of thin air while levitating. This is a really cool moment, but it doesn't end there. You draw attention to the box that started the entire effect, and as they open it, they realize that the spinning top is back in the box. This effect is near and dear to my heart. This is the one piece of magic that I do if I really need to connect with somebody on a special level, if I really wanna emotionally engage them. I go into great detail on the do's, the don'ts, and everything I've learned along the way in perfecting this piece. There's a handful of reasons that performers don't do levitations, and I've tried to combat each and every one of those in the explanation of this trick so you can get out there and start performing confidently. If you're looking for a small piece of close-up theater that will really hit your audience in the heart and the mind, then Grandfather's Top was made for you. So thanks so much for your time and your attention. Until next time, friends, onward.